Hello and welcome back to your own channel Indian Defense Analysis where we bring to you all the latest development happening in the defense sector. Recently Indian Army has released an RFI for the procurement of 10 sets of aerial targeting system of extended range along with 120 lottery munitions. These systems will be procured under by India and fast track procedure in accordance with DAP 2020. Now, since this requirement is under fast track, their acquisition would be expected within one year. Though the order is very small, but the army seems to have started the much needed modernization. I know many of you are fan of Ren Metal and I am also one of them. This requirement of Indian Army is very similar to Ren Metal KZO UAV. Now let's try to understand the details and capability of this system. The 10 set of aerial targeting system which is part of this requirement is going to have three components. The control station, forward control station and an antenna. The control station will be fitted on the launcher vehicle for carrying out mission planning, allocation of munition to forward control station, target selection, mission planning, controlling munition system and their recovery and guide the munition to the target. The forward control station will not be fitted on the vehicle but will be a handheld device to take control of munition once it is launched. It can also guide the munition to the target. The antenna will be used for communication up to a range of 100 km. This will enable communication between onboard communication system on a launcher vehicle and munition system. It will also aid in communication between forward control station and munition system up to a minimum range of 5 km. The launcher vehicle will be a 7.5 ton 4x4 GS vehicle such as Ashok Leland Stallion modified for fitting canister or towing launcher. Also it will have onboard command, control and communication station and power supply. The vehicle will be capable of launching projectile in autonomous mode. The lottery munition which will be used in this system will have a minimum range of 100 km and minimum accuracy of 2 meters CEP. The lottery munition can carry high explosive pre-fragmented warhead or an anti-armor warhead with a minimum weight of 8 kgs. The lottery munition will be able to lotter at a minimum altitude of 300 meters and will have launch altitude of 4000 meter or more. This was today's update. Please let us know your views on this in comment section. If you like the video, do not forget to like, share and subscribe. With this, I would like to say goodbye and Jai Hind. We will soon back with more interesting and amazing development happening in the defense sector.